Welcome to the Twins Podcast, where we inquire about the fascinating world of twins and explore their unique stories. I'm your host, Angel Sarabia, and in today's episode, we're diving deep into the lives of Paula Bernstein and Ellis Chain, twin sisters who discover each other later in life. Paula and Ellie's story is truly remarkable. They were separated at birth and adopted by different families. Both of them grew up completely unaware of each other's existence, leading independent lives with their respective families. It wasn't until they were 35 years old that they began to suspect they'd had a twin. And so, the journey to unravel the truth began. Paula and Elise embarked on a search to find answers, reaching up to adoption agencies, requesting access to their adoption records, and connecting with others who were in a similar situation. Through this process, they discovered that they were indeed identical twins and were part of a secret study on separated twins conducted by renowned psychiatrists Dr. Peter Neubauer. Now, let's talk about the similarities and differences between Paula and Elise. When examining the similarities between these twins, we can categorize them as follows. Number one, physical resemblance. Paula possesses sparkling blue eyes, and so does Elise. Neither of them can deny the strong resemblance in their facial features, with their shared genetics evident. Number two, shared interests and talents. Paula pursued a career in the arts, and Elise too. With Paula as a writer and Elise as a painter, they both have a deep passion for creative expression. Liz had a curiosity about her biological origins, and so did Paula, so they embarked on a joint quest to uncover the identities of their birth parents. Both Paula and Elise appreciate the importance of their bond as twins and have become advocates for the understanding of twinhood. Number 3. Emotional Journey Elise experienced a range of emotions upon discovering her sister and Paula too, including joy, excitement, confusion, and even moments of tension. Paula didn't expect to find a long-lost twin, and Elise didn't either, but the revelation has brought them both a sense of profound connection in a new chapter in their lives. We have already reviewed some similarities, now let's explore some differences. Cultural upbringing Paula was raised in New York City, but Elise grew up in Paris, France. Elise didn't have any knowledge of the existence of her sister, and neither did Paula. Paula embraced the energy of the city, while Elise found solace in the tranquility of nature. Personal Preferences Paula is a night owl and so thrives during the late hours, while Elise is a morning person. Paula has a love for adventure and travel, but Elise prefers the familiarity of home. Neither of them shares the exact same preferences and hugs. Professional Pursuits Paula pursued a career as a writer, and so she uses her words to convey stories and emotions. Elise followed a path as a painter, showcasing her artistic talents on canvas. Neither of them pursued the same artistic medium, but both found creative outlets. Travel and Exploration Paula has traveled extensively to different countries, experiencing diverse cultures and environments. 
Elise, on the other hand, has not explored as extensively as has chosen to stay closer to home. Daily Rhythms Paula's energy peaks during the night time, while Elise finds herself most active in the morning. Neither of them shares the same daily rhythm and energy levels. Nature versus Nurture Paula's experiences shaped her into a city loving adventurous individual. Elisa bringing in Paris in connection to nature influenced her preferences and choices. Both their experiences and environments played a role in shaping their unique identities. In summary, Paula Bernstein and Elise Shane share physical resemblances pursue artistic careers, embarked on a journey of self-discovery, and experienced a range of emotions upon their reunion. However, when it comes to their personalities, there are noticeable differences. Paula and Ellie's story serves as a powerful reminder of the unbreakable bond that twins share, regardless of the circumstances that separate them their journey of self-discovery, and the impact they have made on the adoption community is a testament to their resilience and determination. And that's all for today's episode of Twins Podcast. I hope you found this story as inspiring as I did. Join us next time as we explore more interesting topics. Thanks for listening. Bye for now.